Hey everybody, I'm Adrian Bustamante from YouTube's Food Deconstructed, and today I'm gonna give you some tips on how to sell candy at a flea market. Now, I used to go to flea markets a lot when I was younger with my family, and actually members of my family used to sell things at flea markets, like candy and food and things like that. So, have a little bit of background and kind of the trials and tribulations they went through, so hopefully these tips will help you. Um, the biggest key that ever comes across from anybody when trying to sell candy at a flea market or any type of food is packaging. Packaging is key. They want to make sure that things are sealed, so whether it's a Ziploc bag sealed, whether it's tightly wrapped in like saran wrap sealed, or maybe you have a vacuum sealer at your, at your house that you're going to seal those in. That's a big, big factor. Second is price. You want to make sure that you're pricing your candy out for a good level of mouth that's going to be the same, if not a little bit less, than you would normally buy at a store. If you have to go a little bit more and it's something that's specific to you and you can only get out of your flea market or from your house, then people will usually pay that little bit extra money. So there you have it. And then three is labeling. Using things like Sharpies and white pieces of paper or whatever you have around the house to make sure things are clearly labeled when they're coming up to your table at the flea market. So if you're not available to answer questions, at least people know what they're looking at and how much they're going to cost. So those are just a few tips on how to sell candy at a flea market. I'm Adrian Bustamante.